Welcome to Mark Breed 757. This is week number four weigh in. Well, I would have had a week number three weigh in, but I kind of eh, let it get to my head, you know. Um, I was going to weigh in regardless whether this was a good weigh in or a bad weigh in. This was actually not too bad of one. Uh, I obviously had a weight gain last week and was a little embarrassed to do that, but that's probably the best time to put one. Uh, not realizing it, you know, that's the best time to actually show it. Like, hey, look, I had a weight gain, and I didn't back down. I'm still going. But anyway, I'm going way off track. I did start my weekend off a little bit better. Um, Friday, I ate a little bit more than I anticipated. Uh, I even had a little bit of pizza with the kids, but I've stayed away from pizza for weeks on end. You know, I, I don't really eat too much of it. I Although I did have it last week too. <laughs> joy, joy. But I bounced back today, Saturday, really well. I uh, was on point with eating, on point with exercising. And I exercised yesterday too. So I've been, for the most part, exercising morning and evening. But anyway, here's my weigh-in. Uh, the last weigh-in was 332.9. Let's check out this weigh-in. That's right, it's 332.7. Okay, I lost 0.2 pounds. You know, out of two weeks, I'll take it. That's perfectly acceptable. Like I said, for now on, if I have a gain, I have got to post it and I got to talk about it and I got to say what's going on. You know, it's just ridiculous. I did some more research about different types of exercises. Uh, I've been kind of just doing my own thing like doing swimming in the morning and in the evening just trying to incorporate some more weights and stuff. I've been kind of looking into this circuit training and um, the different types of you know I've heard of HIIT exercises I guess that's based off of like cardio where it's um, you know you, you do like a minute faster pace and then slow down for 20-30 seconds and then speed up again and so forth and so forth. Well, I can't remember the name of it, but basically it's a circuit training where you use resistance. So you're, you either have free weights or you have machine weights or you have the uh, bands, whatever type of resistance that might be, where you pick three to five different exercises and you'll get into the exercise, do it, you move right on to the next exercise, do it, and you don't really have no break, and you just keep going to all those exercises, and then after you complete the three to five different exercises, that's when you get a 60 second to 90 second break, and then you do it all over again three to five times. So you're doing, you know, it could be three sets on each one or five sets on each one which that's cool and then uh, just to do a little more maybe you take a little a good break from that and then probably do another two to three different uh, exercises with resistance training and that could be your total workout for that day uh, I think that would be something I'm really interested in I think that's something that could be very beneficial to me and I could still stick to my swimming in the morning or maybe change it up, do a little bit of walking or maybe do some steps or do, you know, just something. I'm, I'm trying to stay very active. I do notice that I'm gaining a lot more strength and I'm gaining a lot more endurance. However, during my Friday workout, I tried hitting the heavy bag and I hurt my wrist pretty good. So I had to kind of take it easy on the weights. I'm uh, hoping it can recover pretty soon. I, I'm definitely going to stay away from the heavy bag for now on. Uh, anyway, that's all I have for this week. I look forward to doing another video during the Journey to Health Collab where I answer another question. Thank you.